So what the f is a Vietnamese egg coffee? Well, today I'm gonna show you. So in an effort to get out of my office more and get out there more on the streets of Hanoi, today I am launching a brand new series where I take you out in the streets of Hanoi I show you something that I find interesting. Today it's gonna to be an egg coffee. What the heck is an egg coffee? Is it like scrambled eggs inside a coffee? No, but each episode, I'll take you to a new place, show you something unique about Hanoi, unique about Vietnam. I'll take my camera and I'll give myself a little self assignment as well where I have to get one photograph of whatever my subject is. So today, egg coffee, I'm gonna grab my wife, I'm gonna grab my wife, I'm gonna call my wife upstairs and we're gonna get out of here, hit the streets of Hanoi and go enjoy a delicious egg coffee. Baby, you ready? Almost. I can't believe that. So, as for here, today, I'll be taking my Leica M10D, and I've got a 3.5 liter Wolvencraft Pilot Series bag, and I'll make it in leather, and a two liter today, I think, since I'm taking the one camera, one lens, but I also got the gimbal, I will take the 3.5 liter. Ready for an egg coffee? Yes, egg coffee! I need to get some coffee. I have to get any coffee this morning. Sorry, dogs. I'm leaving you for coffee. So what I love about this place is not just the deliciousness of the egg coffee, but it's a location. Location is everything here. So this place is located like one of these traditional Vietnamese tube houses. So on the outside, it just looks like a small storefront selling outsides, the lady sewing. But if you go back, it goes deep and deep and deep in all these layers. And it's located in the, in the old quarter, centrally in the old quarter of Vietnam, the old quarter of Hanoi, and it overlooks Wan Kim Lake. So it's a great location. It's a very ancient location, uh, all the ancient decor here, but that's kind of half of it. The coffee is delicious. We can get egg coffee at other places. The cool thing here is the decor and the experience of having the coffee here. So we'll go up the stairs, around the spiral staircase, up to the roof, and have the coffee up there. They, you order it down here at the bottom, and then you bring it, they bring it all the way up to the top here. All right, Q, tell me how they make this. What is it exactly? So this is egg coffee. It has eggs and coffee, obviously. And then the eggs, you they, they whip it with a little bit of sugar until it's like creamy, fluffy, and then they just pour it on top of the coffee. So when you uh, enjoy this, there's two ways. Either you can mix it up with the coffee and the eggs, you know, have one consistent things, and then you just enjoy it. But for me, I like to eat all the eggs and then eat the coffee, drink the coffee later. So that's just me. You will think that is the dessert because it's sweet and creamy and fluffy. You will feel like you eat um, like creamy, hot, creamy things on top of your coffee. It's a nice balance because the coffee is bitter and then this is just like sweet but tiny bit sweet. It's not like crazy sweet. I like it, but you have to eat it and you know to feel the, the texture and then to to taste how good it is. All right, I thought about photographing the egg coffee, but it's not a very visual thing to photograph. So. I'm just trying to get one shot out of this place. I think the ambiance, where it's located, sort of everything around it is the way to do it. So I'm gonna have my wife, and if I did this for a travel story, I would wait for someone to pass through, but my wife's got a cool hat on today. This isn't journalism. I'm just photographing, looking for nice pictures. Some nice trees to shoot through here, some nice greenery in the foreground. A vantage point, top down, so there she is. I'm gonna have her walk down this little pathway here, and just sort of hang out there and get a nice vantage point, show her hat, and the way that her white hat should pop out nicely. So. That'll be my picture and I'll end with that. I'll show you guys, this is my one photo from my one place, one shot, Hanoi edition, egg coffee edition. Bye for now. The only negative thing about the egg coffee is if you're a bearded fellow or a mustache fellow, you got this issue. It's kind of sticky and creamy, so we gotta be careful.